Yeah, morning. in fact, let's uh, at 518 take a look at uh, live Doppler 13 radar this morning and a couple of things to notice. None of this rain is uh, serious or intense or severe. However, uh, the line is actually growing in intensity a bit coming out of Rensselaer over Indiana Beach. Now Delphi down to Lafayette on I-65. We're seeing this rain. You folks in Crawfordsville, this is knocking on the door of Wabash College uh, from Rockville down to Brazil. We have seen some heavy doses of rain and this is not falling apart. Even though we're getting closer to sunrise, this is actually getting stronger and is on the way to Bainbridge and eventually Danville, Avon and Plainfield. Meanwhile, to the south east of Indianapolis from Shelbyville to Connorsville. There was a heavy cell in Greensburg, but it's raining there and is now moving out. You know, as we've mentioned, only a couple of storm reports. We did have a marginal risk for severe weather. One of those um, yesterday at about 715 last night was around uh, Edinburgh and Johnson County. Some trees were knocked down on US 31, but to our west now, nothing but clear sky. That bodes well for the next few days. Right now, good morning, Monticello. You're at 61. Wabash is cool to 57. Noblesville, you're at 63. And Indy is at 66 this morning. Richmond, 66. So is Rushville and Greenwood and Green Castle and Rockville's at 67. Just under 70 this morning in Nashville, Bloomington, Seymour, and North Vernon. But later on, these dew points are going to drop into the 40s. What does that mean? It means we're going to take the humidity out of the atmosphere, and it's going to be really lovely. If you're headed to the Indianapolis Zoo today, perfect day to go. 73 by 2 p.m. That's uh, wonderful. And then our dry pattern continues into Friday. It'll actually be crisp and cool from Green Bay to Minneapolis up into Canada. But here it's going to be in the mid to upper 70s tomorrow. So if you're going to the Fish Quintet playing at uh, Ruoff Music Center, first of three concerts, temperatures actually falling into the 60s. So let's show you what the rest of the day looks like. These showers are going to move out by lunchtime, and then this north-northwesterly breeze brings us a really pleasant day today. And as you'll see, through the weekend too, we'll go from 75 today to 78 Friday, Saturday 80 degrees, Sunday up to 82, and it means you got to mow your yard the next four days because it is going to rain, Kelly, uh, much of next week.